but I would, and just to get a reaction from people. But I don't understand why there's so much hate for this band that has done nothing wrong. They stay out of trouble. What's the guy's name? Chad Kroger, right? He dated Avril Lavigne. I thought that was cool. Yeah. Can't go wrong with I, that. I understand. I understand they're they're a little pop here and there. They try to be heavy. Maybe there's a little bit of an identity crisis going on. But the guy has a really good voice. And Mike, we on Instagram this past week we uh, we had a poll on. We asked. Uh, in fact, the, hopefully the poll's still on there when this show airs. There were a bunch of people that said they liked the comeback but would never admit it. I'm on here and I'm admitting it. But as a musician, and I'm not a musician, you are. Why do people have such strong feelings and hatred towards a band that's been around for a while? They're a great band. Why? I agree with you. Um, I don't see the reason for it. I, I, I think they're good. Again, I never really went out and bought any of their albums, but every radio rock song I heard, I don't know. I think people just um, perhaps are despise the success that they had. I mean, they had one of the most spun records of whatever year that, um, what was that song? Their first their first hit when that came out. It was the most spun tune of the year. It's just overplayed. Um, I think I kind of liken it to, the, you know, and I'm not a sports guy, but you brought up everyone hates the Dallas Cowboys. I think it's kind of the same thing. Every Everybody needs their, their something to hate, you know? Um, and I think they chose Nickelback to, to kind of carry that flag. I, super success they had that I don't get it I, you know I think they're good um our lead singer had a huge thing we're not playing Nickelback we're not playing Nickelback and you just answered you know, my next question yeah so you guys so don't do Nickelback we don't do Nickelback I I was in another band temporarily and I got to do it and it was fun and I loved it um but yeah there are certain people that just yeah won't do it so yeah I mean there's a legitimate reason to hate the Dallas Cowboys they're a hateable <laughs> team Nickelback has done nothing. This guy's, I mean, check, these guys, they stay out of trouble, right? They seem to be out of the news. They, the only, and, and, and the thing, that, and the, here's the thing that I don't understand, and this is the thing that baffles me. And again, if anybody knows anyone connected with the band Nickelback, I want them on the show. It'll be a very friendly interview because I, I am, I am pro Nickelback. I really am. So if anybody knows their marketing people, their PR people, the band themselves, any connection at all, let's get them on the show and let's talk about this because I am pro Nickelback. I don't understand it because you're right. People do like to, do hate to see people have success. I get that, but there are plenty of other bands out there that have success that are not hated as much. And the thing is, right? Somebody likes Nickelback. 